Hey guys, this is Shubhamdeep. Today I will explain how to use library function in the C programming language. Okay, so here I have a list of library function which is square SQRT means square root and log CL and power and land. Okay, so I will tell you what is the use. I mean how it works with the program. Okay, so here is the description and these are the functions ok so sqrt is useful for calculating the square root of a number which is j uh, means that number which i will provide between presses ok and log is a natural logarithm of j base e and still rounds to j uh, its mean is that uh, uh, i mean self uh, function is actually rounds the value means uh, suppose uh, you have any value 5.2 so if you use this function then uh, 5.2 will be converted into 6 okay suppose 4.2 yeah 4.7 like this it will converts in non figure like uh, uh, 4.5 means 5 and 4.7 means 5 4.1 means 5 and 2 point something means 3 okay so this kind and power function is useful for calculating the power of the j raised to the power k means uh, j will be the number and k will be the power i mean uh, power of that number okay and uh, random variable is mean its mean is random okay that's mean uh, if we use this number i mean this function so it will generate a uh, random numbers in the program in the output screen okay so uh, let's just uh, start so first uh, i'm gonna tell you here the uh, objective of the program write a program to calculate the cube of a number and then calculate the square root of that number using function okay so this is the uh, objective means i have to calculate the cube of a number and then i will calculate the square root of the number of that number which has been calculated as a cube okay so here i think i don't need to tell you uh, anything because i have i have been told you what is these i mean it's a uh, global global initialization of the functions and here you can see that i have integer a variable m and n and float a variable p okay so this statement will say that in any value suppose i will provide any value and that value will be stored at the address of n and again i am calling here cub function which is which definition is written down here okay so i am calling cub function here and uh, the controller will transfer from here to here and it will execute this block okay so here i am calculating the cube of the number n okay here you can see that n into the power 3 okay and after that that result will be stored at uh, 3 and here i am transferring th uh, c to to here okay and this result means c will be copied will be saved to m and uh, after that i am printing m then again i am passing i am calling sqr sqrt i mean square root of function with m okay m which have been calcul calculate the value of i mean calculated cube okay of number so this is a simple concept and the definition of sqr square root function is written down here okay so you can it's a so simple program i'm just uh, using two function and one function for cal calculating the cube of the number and another function is usual for calculating the square root of cube number okay so now i'm going to run this program so here in any value suppose i provide three okay so you can see that the cube of the number is 27 and the square root of of the number is five point something this is okay so this is the concept of okay so mm, actually i want to tell you क्या कर रहे हो वैसे फॉर पॉइंट समथिंग आ गया क्योंकि हमने यहां पे इंटीजर टाइप वेरिएबल लिया है एंड वैल्यू इज फ्लोट फ्लोट आर तो स्क्वायर मतलब क्यूब तो जैसे नंबर लो जिसका स्क्वायर मतलब स्क्वायर जो है वो 9 
तीन का क्यूब कितना आएगा उनतीस सत्ताईस चौसठ चौसठ का स्क्वायर रूट कित अठेटी आठ ठीक Okay, so I'm going to run this program. So it's asking any value for suppose I enter four. Okay, so you can see that the cube of the number is sixty-four and the square root of the number is eight. Okay, so this is a simple concept and you can easily understand this. Okay, so now I have another program. This okay here you can see I have a hmm yeah. Do wait please. Yeah, you can you can see that I have the integer variable i and n and has a value five and actually meaningless here. Okay, so you can see that I'm printing only rand. Okay, means it will generate random values. Any random values, uh, uh, you will see with the program with the example. Okay, you can see that uh, first value is forty one and another is eight forty. Eighteen, forty-six, seven, six, double three, four, and these kind of okay, and it's a printing five times because I am executing loop from one to I mean five times zero to four. Okay, so this mean it will uh, generate it will print five time random values. Okay, so this is the concept of this function. And last is last is here is the log of and you can see that um, this program is. Is con is containing the use of all uh, library function is square root log cell and uh, power. You suppose I enter five point uh, two. Okay, here. Yeah. So now I'm going to run this program. You can easily understand the square root of the, and is this is now. Also enter. Enter any value four. Suppose I entered four and the square root of n is two. Okay, and the log of uh, n is this this, and the sine of n is six. Okay, you can see that here and the power of uh, four raised is sixteen. Okay, here you can see that I am calculating the uh, I mean n k power two and To the power two, and here I am using five point two for uh, for demonstrating the use of this function, and it will print six. Okay, so this is the concept of these li library functions. So if you have any problem, you can put on my channel. Okay, so thanks for watching. Keep learning, and bye. Okay, and don't so forget to subscribe, please. Okay, now bye.